All right, guys, welcome to my channel today. Today, I want to show you two items that were sent to me by Mooncool so that I could show you. And uh, they're pretty interesting things. This here is a electric inflator. So you can inflate your tires on your bikes and tires on your car. Um, it'll blow up rafts. Once you have that raft blown up and you want to put it back in your car, you can suck the, uh, the uh, air right out of the raft because it has the ability to vacuum the air out too. Um, so it's, it's pretty uh, multi-use here. It's got a flashlight built into it, so let's take a look at this thing. So this thing comes with the instructions in many different languages, so you'll be able to figure it out comes with a little bag so that when you finally throw the box away you can throw everything in the bag this is the hose that you put in the top for blowing up your tires or basketball or whatever because it comes with all that stuff too this is the little hose that you would be blowing up your raft with or sucking the air out of your raft and it comes with multiple adapters for that too so we have a usb charger so you can charge it by usb in your house or you could charge this thing in your car. So if you would go onto the beach, you blew up your raft, the thing died, you can plug it right in and run it that way too. So you've got all these adapters here that will um, go onto this hose here and you can blow things, you can suck things, you can do anything with it. So I will show you that. We've also got, you know, for your Schrader valves and for your Presta valve, we also got little things that look like they blow air. Um, so let's look at the pump itself. This thing's pretty nice. It's big though. It's not something I think you're gonna carry on your bike with you because, uh, I don't know, it's pretty large to carry on your bike. It's not something that I'd wanna carry. Maybe if I was on the trike, you know, you could do that. Um, I carry a smaller pump than this on my bike. And I also, on some of the bikes, I've got those bottle things that uh, you can pull the tire up with those, the CO2 ones. So, all right, let's look at this thing here. You got your on off button here, so that turns it on. You got a nice digital display on this thing. It shows you your battery charge is, is full on this. This is on a car right now, so that it's ready to blow up a car tire. You can switch what you're on. This is now to blow up a basketball. Um, this here is to blow the air out or to suck down the raft that you blow up. And this is for your bike. So pretty nice. So if it's on bike, you can put the, uh, the uh, pressure up on it to what you want to go. So if you wanted, uh, I don't know, say you wanted uh, 40 pounds in it. So we'll set this to 40 pounds. And then you hit the on button here. And that would pump up to your 40 pounds and shut off when it gets there. So it's pretty nice. You also got a light on this thing. So you can use it as a flashlight or if you were outside and you were trying to blow up your tire and couldn't see, you'd have the light there. Also, if you were in an emergency situation, you've got a little uh, flashing light here. And you've also got your SOS here. So um, quite a few things can be done with this thing. You've got ports on the top. You, you can charge in these ports. And I believe you can also charge your cell phone off these ports if you wanted to also. This is where you would put in the hose on the top here so that you could then uh, blow up uh, whatever you were going to blow up, whether it's your car or whatever. Um, so you got that. And again, like I said, you've got all these adapters here that you can use. And the other thing on it, I'll show you um, as far as like blowing up the raft. Um, you've got this hose here. You would put one of these adapters on it. Um, like say this thing here, you wanna, wanna blow something. So you screw that in, and this goes in the bottom here. This is an in and an out. So the out one would be blowing, so we'll put that in. We'll hit the, uh, gotta change this again over to the blowing thing, which is right here, and we'll turn it on. And it blows. So there's air coming out of this thing now. And if you put it in the end, other side here, it will suck. So now this is sucking in. So like I said, uh, pretty handy little unit here, guys. So keep this thing in mind if you uh, are interested in buying it. It's on the Moon Cool website. <sighs> Don't quote me, but I think it's $79. Um, but it's on there. These things uh, you really find a pump 
you know, cheaper than like 49. So um, is it, you know, a lot of money? Yeah, but you're getting a lot here. You're getting um, multiple things this thing can do, and it's a quality piece. So, you know, all right, guys, this is what the bag looks like when you throw everything in. It fits in there nicely. Now I can put it in my cabinet, and uh, when I need it, it's there. So if you want it, it's on their website. It, check it out, guys, and uh, we'll check out their other item. All right, guys, this is the second item that Mooncool sent to me. Thank you very much, Mooncool, by the way. These things are awesome. I like these a lot. Uh, I've already used them twice now. So uh, I put them back in a box so it looks like, you know, we haven't used them yet, but we have used them. So these things I have synced to my phone through Bluetooth. These are Bluetooth glasses, guys. These are uh, cycling glasses, so they're a bigger glass. Um, they uh, go right over my glasses here. I've been wearing them right over the glasses, but you don't need, I mean, if you don't wear glasses, they're fine. Um, but they do work with my glasses, which is great for me because when uh, I found out I was getting these things, I'm like, ah, I, you know, I wear glasses, so. But they go right over it. I'm gonna show you, uh, I've been listening to my music when I go. It's great. comes in a nice little case here too. Um, we've got instructions on how to sync it Bluetooth wise. You don't need the instructions, trust me. You turn the glasses on, the light starts flashing, pick out your phone, go to your Bluetooth, uh, find it, it, it there. I think it's, um, I don't know, something M3 or something like that. Um, and then pick it, and once it's it's hooked up, you're good to go every time. They, it just goes right in again. So the glasses come in a nice little case here. You've got a little hanger so you can put it on your belt loop, and um, it'll hold on the, there. So if you don't have to have them you know, all the time, you can put them back in the case. Uh, it comes with all kinds of packing, but I took the packing off because I've been using them, like I said. Get a little thing to clean them. You've also got a charging thing for a USB. Um, this is really important that you don't lose this because this is pretty proprietary to the glasses because it's magnetic and it sticks on uh, this thing on the side here. So it sticks right on and then you plug this into a, uh, a port to charge glasses. So you, you turn this thing on, there's a speaker here, a speaker here. This thing also has a microphone in it so that you can answer your phone calls. You get a phone call when you're out there cycling, you can hit OK, and you can talk to them while you're driving down the road. Um, you may have to pull over because of wind noise, who knows. But uh, So these things, like I said, they go right over my glasses. They stay there, no problem. And um, I've been using them, I'm saying I, and I can have my music on. So um, all you gotta do is turn them on. There's a little button here, press on it. It actually tells you that it's hooked up. There's a voice that comes on, it's connected. Um, also, when you turn them off, it tells you it's off. And if you don't hear the off, they keep coming back on. So wait for them to say off before you uh, release your finger off the, the thing. So I put them on like this. Like I said, I can drive down the road and I can play music. So I don't know if you can hear the music. I'll turn it up. Maybe you can hear it or not. It's a Blue Oyster Cult, guys, but it's pretty nice. Like I said, I can go out on a bike, listen to my music. I can still hear everything around me, which is great. I gotta turn this down because it's too loud. Um, but these things are great. Uh, this is what they look like if you didn't have glasses on. Um, they tint in the sun so that they're sunglasses also. And they're nice and wide, so you go by sticks or you know trees hanging out, especially this time of year where everything's overgrown. Um, it's great; you don't get hit in the eye. And like I said, for me, I wear them right over the, the other glasses, not a problem. I get out there, I can hear my music, and uh, they work great. They're on the website, guys. I think uh, again, I want to say they're like seventy-nine dollars, something like that. Uh, but I think they're worth it. Um, they like, you know. I love listening to music when I drive, but I don't want to get distracted. So this is a very nice way to have the music in the background. Um, I can keep it low like I have it now. It's on. You guys probably can't even hear it. Um, and I can hear everything around me. I can hear a car coming or whatever. Really nice instead of having earbuds in. So check them out, guys. Uh, I think you'll like them. And uh, if you like my content, uh, please hit subscribe and hit the like button on the way out. Thank you very much, guys.